Hi everyone, welcome to the world's quickest tutorial for GB Studio on how to increase either the number of simultaneous projectiles on the screen at once or uh, the number of unique projectiles per scene. So all you have to do is go game, advanced, eject engine, eject that engine. I've already done it, so I'm gonna replace it. And then we're gonna head over to include and projectiles.h. And here we have the include file for projectiles. The part that matters is here. We have definition of maximum projectiles. Now this defines um, the maximum number of projectiles that can be on the screen at once. That's any projectile. They can only have up to five by default on the screen at once. And then new projectiles won't spawn. And next we have the definition for maximum projectile definitions, which is also five. Uh, so this is how many unique projectiles you can have per scene. What counts towards a projectile's uniqueness? Everything on the left here. So if any of these things are different, even one thing is different, uh, that means the projectile is unique and you can only have up to five per scene. And then on the right, all of these things don't count towards a projectile's uniqueness. Uh, you can change them between launch projectile events, and that won't count towards a unique projectile. So what do we need to do to change these values? Well, for starters, we have to go ahead and add underscore defs so that this uses max projectile defs. For some reason, it doesn't. It doesn't really make any sense. But anyway, let's change that. Um, and then we can change these numbers. So say I want to have six unique, unique projectiles. I'm going to change this to six but I'm also gonna decrease the maximum amount of projectiles on screen at once to four. So if we increase one of the values, we want to decrease the other one by the same amount to make sure RAM doesn't overflow. We wanna keep memory nice and balanced and we can do the opposite. So say these are both five, I'm gonna go ahead and increase the number of projectiles on screen at once to six, but maximum projectile definitions decrease to four. So you can choose whatever combination you like, um, as long as it adds up to 10. Uh, when I was making a shmup, I increased this to 7, I increased this, or decreased this to 3, because, you know, I only had the player projectile, um, enemy projectile that was multi-purpose, and then an extra unique enemy projectile. That's only three projectile definitions, so I only wanted three. I increased my maximum projectiles on the screen at once to seven so I could have as much chaos as possible. That's pretty much it. Uh, don't forget to save your file. Well, that pretty much wraps up this video. Uh, be sure to check out my website, GB Studio Lab, where I have a bunch of written and other video tutorials on doing cool stuff in GB Studio. And also I have a link to my Patreon over there if you wanna help out, shameless plug. But uh, that'll wrap it up. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.